Well, he's back and he's smiling as you would be when captaining the Australian side. So a very good uh, victory tonight. It was absolutely. It's a very good team effort, I think. Um, for us to be able to post 250 was a was a good effort, I think. 280. We we're thinking around 280, but um, the way things worked out, Matthew Wade and uh, and Dave Hussey batted beautifully to be able to get us to 250. And in the end tonight, the the wicket probably changed a little bit. The, um, the wicket probably greased up a little bit, so um, it went through a bit more than it did when we batted, and um, ended up meaning that we could actually bowl the, the lines and lengths that we wanted to to these guys to be able to test them out, and it, and it went well. Bit of a surreal feeling coming back into the side and then being named captain. It is absolutely, yeah. To think that, um, yeah, I've, I've come back in. Like I've been working very hard to be able to get get back over the last, well, throughout the whole summer. So um, to be able to come back and play play a game this summer is um, is a really nice feeling. Then to be thrown the captaincy and be able to um, win the first one is um, it is very yeah, it's a real feeling. Feeling, no doubt. How are you feeling at the moment? You bowled a few overs, took a couple of wickets. You'll have to do something. You didn't get any runs, <laughs> so it's nice to be able to get a um, get a couple of wickets and um, you know, try and try and chip in in, in ever, any way I could. So. Um, it worked out really well in the end. Try and describe the feeling of coming back into the Australian side. Great dynamic, big crowd here, it's always good to see. Absolutely, this is um, what I was missing out on all summer. Um, to be able to come to the SCG is you know, one of my favourite grounds in the whole world. So um, to be able to come here and see just about a capacity crowd is the reason why you play. It's very exciting. Well, it's great to have you back, mate. Congratulations on the first up winners, Captain. We look forward to seeing a lot more of you in the future. Thanks, Pete. Cheers, mate. Man of the match, David Warner's joined us on CATV. Mate, a very solid innings at the top for you. Yeah, it was, and it was disappointing how I got out. Um, you know, we had good momentum uh, there. We're going, you know, five, six, and over with uh, with Dave there, and you know, we didn't cap. I didn't capitalise on that, and I played a false shot, and uh, you know, led to the dismissal of myself. Do you reckon it's one of those times that you're always looking for more runs? You're so hungry for runs that even when you make a, a good score, you're looking for more. Yeah, you know, you think you're in at some stage, and you know, you just really want to, you know, itch and, and and take the aggressive approach. And you know, it was lazy for, uh, for me. You know, I I should have went on and, and made a hundred there, and uh, you know, posted three hundred on the board there for us. But obviously, you know, we're still got across the line. You always love making runs, but you love winning almost more than that. Good feeling in the side at the moment? 100%. You know, we're going to the next game with no pressure, and uh, we know now that we're through, and, uh, you know, the boys are excited. So hopefully, you know, come around Melbourne, um, the boys can play freely, and uh, we can actually put 300 on the board. You played a lot of cricket this summer. Do you still enjoy it? You're still looking at getting out there and just looking forward to it every day? 100%. You're playing for Australia. Um, you know, that's what, that was my ambitions as a kid, and, you know, I'm here now. So, you know, it's obviously I'm going through a bit of mental fatigue, but uh, but I'm enjoying it. It's a test of character for myself, and uh, I want to keep playing at this at this uh, elite level for the next 10 years. I've got, to, you know, I've got to battle through that. Well, congratulations today. We look forward to seeing you next week. Cheers, Pete.